If you've been playing online in Dragon Ball Sparking Zero recently, especially DP Battle, you would know it's a sweat haven at the moment. I'm talking after image teams. I'm talking teams of five where all they try and do is outlast the timer. I'm talking unblockable ultimates. I'm talking Broly's, Beerus's. It's painful. One of the best teams to counteract that while still being able to have some fun and not feel too sweaty is the Ginyu Force. I'm going to show you before we get into it exactly why, not just because they're a team of five, that alone on DP Battle makes it very, very viable, but they all have a spin around move. Every single one of them can spin their opponent around, which is a key kind of little combo you want to use because obviously back shots are, are dirty in this game. And then they all have Insta Spark. Every single one of them has their own little pose. They Insta Spark, which is dope. And then each of them has a separate skill, which is a utility for them. Captain Ginyu, even if you're getting your ass beat, you can use their body change. I did that yesterday when I was streaming. By the way, check out my streams. Streaming on YouTube, maybe Twitch soon. I'm going to try as well. But anyways, you can kind of change bodies even when you're getting your ass beat, like I did yesterday on stream. And then you just turn the tables. And then you got Jace. He's got an explosive wave, a nice little special... Nice little defensive move i guess you would say then you got your boy goldo which i mean paralysis is never a bad thing but it is kind of hard to hit then you got birder he got his after image not after image strike to be fair you only get one one go at it so you can only dodge one attack but still it's a nice little utility and raccoon's little false courage which boosts his uh his defense is always a bonus because then little little characters can't move you very well or they can't stagger you, I would say, unless they do a, a staggering attack. So let's just get into the online scene and show you just how dirty this team is online. And there it is. There's the squad, man. You gotta love the little special voice lines they got. That's awesome. Look at them posed up. You just gotta love the Ginyu Force. It's just fun. All right, y'all. We got our first match. And I'm starting off with Ginyu just because... I'm, I posted a Ginyu video earlier last week, I think it was. And it actually did pretty well for me. I... Appreciate the support on that one, guys. A couple of you guys wanted another Ginyu video, and I figured, you know what? This is a nice way to kill two birds with one stone. Make a little Ginyu sequel video and play as the Ginyu Force. And also, Ginyu is just probably the best, like, for me at least. Maybe aside from Birder, the best character to play as. Like, the one that I'm the best with. And so I can cook people, and then if I end up getting really low health, I'll just switch bodies with their second or third character. I did that a few times on stream the other day. And that brings me to my question while we have this Spanish war that they need to fix. Who is your favorite Ginyu Force member, guys? For me, it probably is Ginyu. I don't know, just something about him is just dope. Not just the body changing, but I don't know, his design I like. Even his... his oh, shit. His little ball sack head, I just... It's, 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 a, it's a cool design for me, I don't know. I don't want to hit him with my ultimate because... If he hits me with his, I'm hitting him with mine. Uh-oh. I don't think he can block this. And this thing is a whole movie. Oh, he missed it all. Well, I'll take that. I'll take it. I'll take it. Hit you with the Galaxy Dynamite or whatever this stack's called. Oh, nice. Nice dodge, man. Okay, he's kind of cooking me, I'll admit. I'm playing a little too casual. I'm playing a little too casually. And low health. Low health? <laughs> We're gonna get your body. I think I got him. Unless he dodges. Got him! Hey, you can have my bar of health. Enjoy it. Yep. 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 I know this guy's pissed. I know he's pissed. I know he's pissed. I know he's pissed. I would be too. Now, I kind of wish I got Berserk killed, but we'll take what we can get. It's, it's all good. Oh, okay. He's gonna switch out, isn't he? Oh, I knew it. Couldn't catch him. That's the thing. When you body change with Ginyu, I can't switch out now. Like, I don't have the option to switch out. I don't know if that's a bug or if that's how they designed it. But yeah, I basically gotta play until Kill dies. Which is fine by me, because she is my weakest character. Because obviously I can't use any of her skills. <laughs> I'm through his third character, basically. I'm a sh it's a shame Shrunk's got to, uh... Got to leave, but... Again... But Trunks does have very little health, and there you go. He rage quit. He's he's pissed. He's pissed that he can't kill my Ginyu. This is what the Ginyu Force does to people. I didn't have to use a second character. And I washed his whole team. Hey guys, so I actually ended up skipping this fight. You're gonna see in the next fight, I pretended like it never happened because it pissed me the fuck off. 
This guy was just playing for time. He ended up winning. And a lot of people play for time, but I don't know, something about this fight just made me want to pull my hair out. And I was quiet for almost all of it, so I ended up kind of skipping it and pretending like it didn't happen. I'm a little bit embarrassed. But hey, while I got you, I mean, why don't you just come on, like the video. If, on a little channel, it, it would mean a lot to me. Subscribe if you're new. Like, what does that really mean to you? It's free. If you feel like hitting the join button and becoming a member, that would mean so much. It would ensure I can do this long term. But of course, that's not an obligation. Do whatever you want with your money. And now let's get into the next fight where I pretend like the previous one didn't happen. All right. As we get into the second match, I will say that Ginyu's ultimate is unblockable, which is what makes it so dirty. Because, sure, you can teleport it, but when you're so close range, like it's really, really hard to time it, even if you're really good at the game. And uh, I did let Ginyu shine last fight, so we're going to give somebody else a chance. We're going to let Goldo do his thing here. He's probably the most annoying member to lose to lose against. All right, get Goldo out here. Get our boy out here. He's switching out too. Spolpovich. Oh, does this guy have a team of five? Take this rock. Eat the rock. Oh, he blocked the rock. Okay. No, not good. Not good. Not good. God damn, this guy's so ugly. I think I got him. Freeze him in place, Goldo. You got him. You got him, Goldo. Finish him. Man, this guy's been pissing me off. Gross. I'm not about to use it. No, Goldo. 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 Oh, shit. God, and he ran away. I respect the Turles. I respect Turles, but like, ah, this guy's playing for time. I feel like if you have one bar or less, you should not be able to run away. Like, it should just, it should block you from running away. Also, I will mention what I just did there was kind of dirty, I'll admit. I know this guy's pissed. I know he's pissed. I would be. I would be pissed if I was him. I know he is. Got his body. Let me take your body. I, en I would enjoy that body very much, Gohan. Very, very much, NBA Dave. And then I'll get rid of his uh, his ability to full power charge and all that stuff and go Super Saiyan. And launch ultimates. Just rely on our ability to play the video game as normal. Like, man, he's actually good at that. I don't know many people that can do the up square like he's doing damn okay chill out wait you can you can up square in the middle of an attack like that was in the middle of my little look again in the middle of my kick attack i didn't even know you could do that bro this guy's so annoying with his up square like very very annoying gotcha gotcha bye bye old body Oh my god, and the Broly too. Guy with his unblockable ultimates. I really should have waited for Broly to come out to switch bodies. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We know what he's going for. We know what he's going for. I'm blocking. Oh, can you not block that attack? That, that would be very annoying if you can't block that attack. Ow. Oh no. Crap. Okay. Fair enough. Fair game. Fair game. Ginyu's gone. Ginyu and Goldo both gone. Why do I do that? You really can't block that attack. Wow. Am I just messing up or can you not block that? Somebody tell me down below. 15k. Okay, this Broly's cooking me, guys. This Broly's cooking me, I'll admit. This Broly's cooking me. What the fuck's going on? No! No, 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 no. Such bullshit, man. Broly is just fucking broken. Like, he's legit broken. But I can't believe I somehow won on time when I only have two characters left. I think he has at least three. But I'll take it, man. This guy deserves to lose. Ah, fucking Broly. Fix the fucking unblockable. First of all, if that is actually an unblockable rush... That needs to be fixed. That can't be a thing. Maybe I was just not blocking. It could be possible. You can't give a character an unblockable rush and an unblockable ultimate. Pick one or pick none. Actually, it's probably better. All right, though. We got Goldo his chance. Now let's give Raccoon his chance. Oh, Beerus, you gotta be fucking kidding me. At least he costs 10. But I know exactly what he's going to be going for off the, off the rip. I did just say I'm going to give Raccoon his chance. But I think I might need to body change this guy. Because I do not want him to use his unblockable ultimate. No! Can you no! Wow! Wow! 
Look at me. Look at me with the freaking... Oh, my. Oh, you know what I said before about switching? All right, here we go. Give him Rukuma's chance. Give me Rukuma's chance. Oh, boy. Here we go. Ow. That little health. And, of course, he switched. Of course, he switched. Let me switch, too. By the way, when I was doing that, I was literally just spamming up in square. I wasn't doing, using any skill. So that's why they need to change it, because it takes absolutely no skill. And it's so easily abusable. Fucking finally, man. I don't know how much of this I'm going to cut down, but fuck. This is why I don't like... I think I'm using mine first. I think I'm using mine first. I think I'm using mine first. Yes. Yes. We got him. We got him, R2. We got him, R2. I'll take it. I don't know. I'll take it. Go only as one bar of health. If you're going to waste it on him. I don't mind. Didn't hit. Didn't hit. I was too close to you, bro. I was too close to you. Hey, hey. Yeah, now I'm happy, huh? Uh-oh. This is actually going to hit me. Oh, not. Or not. Or not. We'll take or not. I think this guy's giving up. Yeah, he gave up. He quit. Man, if you're going to try and play a dirty team, a disgusting, unblockable ultimate after Urban Strike team, like, stick to it until the end. Stop being so fucking scared. At least I can have a modicum of respect if you just stick to it not quit when things don't go your way fucking little babies man all right in this match i know last match was pretty scuffed Rakum did get to play but he didn't get to sh didn't really get to shine but this match i'm gonna use jace ah uh, where's jace jace give me jace give me jace bitch him around get him jace with your lovely dancing moves bro Jace is great because his, his spin around attack is like one move into his combo, which is absolutely lovely. It's exactly what you want to see from a spin around. When it's four, four into the combo, like Ginyu's is, it's a little harder to get sometimes. All right. Sorry, Goku. Sorry, Goku. Yeah, yeah. I'm so sorry, Goku. Uh, I'm a little sweaty now. I've entered sweaty mode from the last match. I've become a bit of a villain. My grandma kill you is this guy's name. You know what? I don't feel bad anymore. Wow. I may play this whole team with Jace. Grab him. Nice. See, one reason I like Jace is I like the kick-based characters. I have characters who kick a lot. Oh, Broly, you're kidding me. Like, that's why I like Vegeta more than Gogeta. I don't know. I just like the kicks. Here, I want to hit him with my Crusher Ball, actually. I just, I just like the Crusher Ball attack. Hey, there you go. And full power. All right. You're 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 playing a Broly. You play a Broly, you get no sympathy at all. And again with the ultimate. No mercy, Broly. I should have done this to the last guy. Wow, that's the fight. And that's the fight. Jace, man. Jace really the MVP out here. The Ginyu Force is second in power. Only to our mighty Lord Freezer. Nah, come on. Don't sell yourself short, Jace. You're first in power. And now I'm in A rank. Oh, boy. I don't even want to know what that's going to look like. Okay. This might be the last match of the video because it's time for Birder to shine. All right, Birder, where you at? Birder is so difficult to, like, block against because his attack... He does, like, 15 attacks in a second. Like, look at that. I know it's not like you guys haven't seen me play as Birder already in the video. I had to play against that other guy, but... Oh, shit. How? I'll be honest. I think I clicked circle for perception, like, half a second before he... He launched that attack. That's how. And full power. All right, whoever gets this basically launches their ultimate. And if Birder dies here, I might have to do another another fight to uh, let his powers go on display. Yep, okay. Yep, okay. I gotta do another fight then. Gotta do another fight. But uh, let's, uh, let's, uh, it's gonna be Ginyu, isn't it? Yes. Yeah, you use after image, you use after image, this is what you get.
He still has after image active. Like, you really gotta... You really gotta reduce the amount of time after image is active in the game. Here we go again. He's about to activate it again. Honestly, let, let him hit me. And I gotta hit him with the ultimate. I gotta hit him with the ultimate. I don't know if it's actually gonna work on his after image or not. It does work. Yes. I gotta get rid of that freaking annoying ass after image attack. All right. There's that guy. Your fate is whoa. Yeah, I guess it does. I guess it does. Who's out next? You still got three characters left. Oh, he was right in front of you. Boldo, he's right in front of you. I'm blocking. Can you block this attack? Because I'm definitely blocking. Okay, I was blocking and now I think I got him. Yes. Nice, Goldo. Nice. I think Goldo's is unblockable. That's why I really like it. I'm not even locked onto him. I hit him with my ultimate. Come on, mate. You're getting you. Not good. 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 Not good at all. Okay. Again, the same as Birder. Winner of this gets his ultimate. Oh, thank God. Okay, please finish him. I don't think it's actually going to finish him. Uh-oh. No, not good, not good. Wow, he actually ran away. He actually ran away. I cannot believe this guy. I cannot believe this guy. Oh, my Lord. Woo, Raccoon versus Gohan. This is... This is the fight right here. Wait, who wins? Oh, yes, Raccoon. Hold it down. My God, do you see how sweaty it is online, people? Do you see? We're going to do one more just for the sake of having Birder fight. All right, all right. This is Birder's round. I can feel it. Oh, GT Goku. At least he's not base form. So he's not going to use after image. Got him. Bro, the spin around is just too... M Why is it... It's been whiffing a lot lately. I thought it was my connection. But I don't think it is. Like, it's been whipping a lot. Like, when I shouldn't be dropping combos and I'm just clicking it like normal, it's been whipping randomly. Like again, see? See? Randomly. Oh my god, the screen's shaking. Get up, can you? Get up! Oh my. Get Birder out here. Oh, this guy keeps going for it. Hello? Birder. Again, like, why is it whiffing all of a sudden? Like, random whiffs. Beta! Sorry, buddy, you're not winning this. In fact, I'm just gonna hit you with my regular rush and finish you here. Wow, nice dodge. Oh, Kefla, really? Okay, well, she costs about eight, so... You can only have one more character. He really keeps going for that. Got my ultimate active. Sorry, Kefla. Sorry, Kefla. Sorry, Kefla. And hit him with the ultimate. There we go. I thought he was going to dodge it again. Whoo! Maybe Birder. Maybe I thought Birder would be my best character, but I guess not. He is a lot of fun to use with his quick attacks, but... It looks like Jace probably has been my best this fight. And, and Ginyu in this video. Again. Spin around. Vanish War. I'm going to win it. And I'm going to win this one, too. Oh, really? With that? And there's her gone. Okay, Birder, Bird. I know you can do it. I know you have such a little health, but I know we can finish this video pretty. He's got GT Goku and one more character. But if I can't find him... Oh, my God. Great. Great, great. I've, I've lost because my back is turned to him and he's doing an explosive wave. Oh, no, I haven't. Wait, I stopped blocking. No, why did I stop blocking? And let me take that body. Pause, because he is a child. I know he barely has more health than me, but I'm, I'm not trying to get him to spam that explosive wave, because I know that's what he's trying to do. Which isn't even a problem, because to be honest, 
I can block it. It's not an unblockable ultimate, but... Oh. His stamina's gone. Finish him like that, then. Oh, and Pan, huh? All right, Pan, fight your grandpa. I should have switched with Pan, man. Because she has after image strike. Let's let somebody else finish the video, actually. Let's let, uh... I can't switch out. Okay, but hold on. Let him let him finish me. Let him let him cook me. Let him cook me. Because I still have three fighters left. And if I lose with three fighters left, I might as well just quit doing YouTube. Yeah, let's finish with Goldo. The most disrespectful one. Oh. Wow. But actually... Oh, she has after image active. Goldo. 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 Because cause after image is active, I'm sorry. I got to finish it like that. That's what you make me do when you have after image active. Can't dodge key blast. Tell him, Goldo. I'm done collecting this garbage. You already know. All right, guys. I've been recording for a wow, an hour with this Ginyu Force team. I'm going to admit to you guys, because if you made it to the end of the video, I don't, I don't mind admitting it. There was a fight in here that I pretended didn't happen because it pissed me the fuck off. That's why you see only four wins when it should be six in a row or five in a row. So holy fuck, that guy. I don't know what was going on. I ended up losing because of time. And it just pissed me the fuck off. So honestly, I skipped it, pretended it didn't happen. So sue me. So what? Not a big deal. Anyways, guys, as you can see, for the most part, the Ginyu Force is just a viable team online. Five characters and all of them have good utility. All of them have Insta Spark. All of them have the flip around attack. And it's actually fun to use. You don't feel like you're relying on the same old bullshit every single time. I know I use body change a few times. That's that's true. But you can play with them and actually have fun and not have to rely on the bullshit. And with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed. If you made it to the end of the video, I love you so much. Like the video. Subscribe if you're new, of course. Comment your favorite Game Force member down below. And I'll catch you in the next one. Take it easy, guys. And peace.